Wire connection to the charging station. When the wire has been completely laid down, up to the point where it is in front of the charging station, leave about 2 meters of free wire. Check to make sure there are at least 2 meters of free space in front of the station. Before connecting the wire to the charging station, proceed with a particular wire setting to prevent the robot hitting the charging station while operating. Encircle the exposed side of the charging station by placing the wire at a distance of 30 centimeters from it. Go back with the wire close to the station and at a distance of 25 centimeters from the encircling wire up to the connection point of the wire to the station. The wire is now laid down along the whole perimeter, encircling obstacles, arranging specific settings for the robot to work at its best, and limiting secondary or closed-off areas by creating a continuous and unique loop which never has to be cut or crossed. Disassemble the protective cover from the charging station by using the screwdriver. Insert the beginning of the wire on the right hole under the station and the end of the wire on the left hole. Stretch the wire and lay the station down on the predefined position. Cut the surplus wire and skin the wire's protective lining to connect the clamps. Fix the beginning point of the wire on the black clamp and the end point on the red one. Secure the charging station to the ground using the same nails as for the perimeter wire. Connect the power pack to the charging station and the power cord to the power pack. Connect the power cord's plug to the power socket. When the power socket used for the connection is close to a wall, the power pack should be fixed on it at a height of at least 160 centimeters in order to be kept out of reach of children. Check that the LED on the transmitter is flashing. Place the protective cover back on the charging station by using the screwdriver. The robot needs to charge its battery, or batteries according to specs, for 24 hours before the first use. Place the robot in the charging station and press on. After a few seconds, the message charging appears. Press start pause. Pause will then appear and the robot will start recharging until you press play pause again to start it, according to pre-programmed mowing cycles.